Uh, hello and welcome to Arca at Bristol. We've got ourselves a Monday night race. Uh, I was just going to take this as like a practice race, which all of the races here are going to be practice races. For the league, which is the one that actually matters to me. But, uh, well, we got, it was a little bit better strength of field than I expected. Not too many signups, but we got 2.3k. Um, I don't really know what I'm doing yet. Green flag. Yeah, that's pretty much the gist of it. Oops. Because I shouldn't be adjusting things. Driving. One more lap. P5. You've just done a I don't know what lane is the fast lane. To be honest with you. Probably not that. Uh, we got a 14993. That's pretty close to my all time best of 898. I've never been great here at Bristol, so. Not expecting too much. In fact, I expect to be wrecked. That's okay. It would have been better to do a high line. I don't know, tires are getting worn at this point. It's the wall, so that didn't work. I tried to leave a little bit of throttle in it. So rumor has it Derek Justice is fast, so I'll probably watch what he does. <laughs> um, I think what I heard is that you actually want to run the low line, and that seems to save tires best. But I'm not exactly sure, like, what pace you're supposed to take this low line. <laughs> so I'm just, I'm gonna have to watch some other guys. I mean, this is all about learning. I'm just, I'm learning the track. I've never been great here at Bristol, and I want to get better for the race on Sunday. So, just gonna be trying to get better. That's pretty much it. You can really get down by the by the bottom over here. That feels pretty good. Maybe that's what you gotta do. I don't know. I'm not gonna be fast, so I'm not gonna give any tips, because I am terrible, so <laughs> usually I can be like, hey yeah, I found that this works and that uh you know it seems to be better for the tires to do this. And I you like to use this as my brick marker. I don't know anything, so don't listen to anything I say this race. <laughs> I'm going to be watching other people. I'm going to be probably getting run over, probably going to be pretty slow. But uh, the goal is just be faster, just be better than I was when I leave than when I got here. And uh, hopefully that'll be doable. Six isn't so bad, I guess. About a tenth, two tenths off. The fastest guys. So, okay. Hopefully, we get started here soon. Some guys are waiting. Oh, well, there's one guy not here, so we're just going to wait for them anyway. Let's, uh. Got, oh, I forgot to put my brake bias back. I want to put my brake bias back for that bottom line. Shock to see I, I didn't do any of my setup. California in this one. I feel like it says a lot that I didn't even notice. Oh well. We'll do a 10 one. Yeah, buddy. Because short track. That's the end of the session of B6. I just got done with the most miserable, worst B open race I've ever done in my life. <laughs> so I'm kind of half asleep. Hoping this will wake me up. There's probably going to be plenty oh, of things. The tempers are going to flare. Oh, the last one was pretty fun. Just kidding, kidding. Hoping this will wake me up in a good way, but probably in a bad way. What part of California are you from? Tell it all the way from Sacramento, California. That's the capital. Right on. I'm, uh, I'm just a little bit where we're living. I don't know where we're living. That's where I'm living right now. 
Everyone's friends now. Okay, I like, I like Woodland. Woodland. I give it two laps. That's my bet. By two lap two, we're gonna have someone yelling. I'm calling it here. Maybe that's generous, but I'm th I'm thinking we can we're gonna make it through one lap. We're gonna hit lap two, then we're gonna get some yelling. Maybe by the same people that were just talking to each other. I don't know. We'll find out. Maybe it'll be me. Maybe I'm gonna yell at someone. Was that Dave Silver? <laughs> I don't care enough at this point. Like, like I said, I'm half asleep from the last race. I expect this to be bad. So, the most they'll get from me is a snarky remark, which I probably shouldn't do that anyway, either. But we need to follow car number. We got zero. cryptocurrency in front of us, and uh, I don't know what's to our left of us. It's gonna be a survival deal. You're on the outside this time. Oh no, my tires. I'm out of tires. First gear start, I guess. Looks like, uh, not really any tire spin either. Might have to watch out for it. Everything's kind of weird. Like, you can be fine at first and then start getting some tire spin. Which I don't think is how it works in real life. But... I'm pulling down at the start for the people behind me. That guy's probably gonna win the race. Where is he? One to go. Next even, he's, even if he's in the back, he's probably gonna win the race. We got someone starting in the pits, I think. No, that guy's gonna win the race. Going green. Starting from the pits in a race without cautions is a very bold move. He might have not done it on purpose. For some reason, Get Ready starts really early at Bristol. I think maybe because of the dual pit road thing. Well, we'll see how this goes. Like the people that had to go. Inside. Clear. See Derek Justice up there on the low line. That is where I will also be. You're in oh my god, what is happening? So that's an example of how not to be a lap car. This guy is here to wreck people. Car outside. You're on the bottom. Three wide. Outside, All right, that guy's clearly here just to intentionally wreck people. Oh, that was short lived. That's pathetic. <sighs> well, at least we didn't get caught up in that too bad. That's the whole field gone. Hopefully that oh that guy's gonna have a free fast repair too, isn't he? The guy behind is just gonna deep one one. Car outside. Just go around me, please. That's a new fastest lap for justice. Clear high. So we lose some time from a really cool guy that needs to graduate middle school. And then um, let's see where this race leads us. You think? Pace. Where do these people show up whenever they're going to be 20 miles an hour off the pace? Like, I don't get it. Oh, I bet. I'm going to jump. I'll probably jump in someone else's car and watch. I wonder if I'm doing this low line thing correctly. We'll find out, I guess, whenever the tires start wearing a little more. Alright, that guy's doing burnouts on the bottom. Hot take, but there should be... There should not be any fast repairs in any series on iRacing. That's for arcade games. 
I don't care if it's rookie. I don't care if it's whatever. So that one guy is just out here wrecking people on purpose. How sad. All right. Well. Feeling okay though. Uh, personally, the line seems to be working all right. Getting a nice and pitch. Got my brake bias down low. Letting the banking carry me pretty well. I have no idea where anybody is on the track. 2.6 ahead to the next guy we're racing. Five point six to the next guy behind. Go high. Go high. Okay, he's off the track. Go lap car help me by. Thank you, Tin. Assuming we buy. I really hope the one guy's not going to come out and can't come out again. Looks like he's on pit road and hopefully staying there. Okay, someone else. Pop split, by the way. <laughs> I mean, maybe it didn't split. I don't know. I thought it did. Reeling this guy in. He might have some damage. It looked like he got held up quite a bit earlier. Go high. Go high. This guy's intentionally wrecking wow, people. Gary. Yeah, it was. Woo. Is he really not? I don't know how you can possibly be swerving all over the middle of the track like that and not be doing it on purpose. But I guess it was an accident. Unless he's just one of those guys with one of those YouTube channels that purposely tries to make people mad so they can get clicks about trolling on iRacing. Oh wow, very cool. I haven't been back to Ark in a while. It's a real shit show. Let's be careful around this guy. Car inside. Still there. Clear inside. Okay. I half expected him just to hook a right and hit me. We are only halfway through this Bristol event, ladies and gentlemen. Jesus. What is this? Bro, you gotta be kidding me. Oh. I'm so scared. Oh my god. Because of a real race car, you know that? Every time I'm near a different car, I just expect to get hit. Car outside. Up. There's a car exit in the pits. Clear outside if you want it. 
<laughs> oh no. Go high. Slow down a mo. We good, we good. Oh no, the 15's back out. I am 100% convinced that guy's purposely wrecking people. After what he did on, I don't know, was it lap one? The end of lap one. Just sitting in the middle of the track and swerving. Like that was one of the most intentional things I've ever seen. And even if it's not, there's no excuse for that. You cannot possibly do that bad. Slow car download. Go high. Go high. Car outside. Clear. Slow car download. Oh, slow car down low. Okay, don't see it. That's the second time that person's left, I think. I swear, I've seen that name already leave. Okay, Colton. Cup times are pretty consistent. I've cut back up to the five again. A little bit tight there. Okay, that guy I'm pretty sure... Wrecking people on purpose has left. That's good to see. Hopefully, I have the right guy. I hope I'm not accusing the wrong guy, but I think that's the guy that. Oh. Oh, don't pull it off and hit me. Go low. Clear outside if you want it. Jesus. That lap time was 15.8. All right, now we get a pass. That's interesting. Try the high line, get it run on him, maybe. Set that up. This guy at least seems to know what he's doing, and I appreciate having someone to race. Lap traffic coming up. Oh god, someone just took someone else out behind us. You've just done a 16.1. So this lot seems okay. Seems like it got us better than the 5 at least. On pace. He still might have damage though. I don't know his story. God, the incidents are going to be a millennia long. A millennium. I think is the right way to say Century. Decades. It's gonna take a long time. Wonder what the next guy ahead of us, how far they are. Okay, we got guys in the wall ahead. Oh my goodness. I'm so scared. That lap was at 15.9. Okay. Guess I have to go high. Inside. Clear. That was at 16.0. I don't want to be on this guy's outside. Coming off the corner. Oh! He's swerving. Inside. Clear. Slow car ahead. Car ahead. Slow car, slow car download. Go high. Go high. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Excuse me, sir. Outside. Stay low. There is a car on the high side. Clear high. Okay, it looks like he's almost under the wall. I'm really afraid of him coming off and hitting me or something. He's not interested in letting us by, that's for sure. Because why wouldn't you? Car outside. 
Fine. The only reason I even want to bother is because it looked like I was gaining on second place, but not more. <sighs> I cannot believe we're about to make it to the end of this thing. This right here was an ARCA iRacing event. <laughs> Track feels a lot emptier now than it did before. Cast off their load. Go high. Well done, Colton. Great drive. That's a podium. We have survived. Right. Got a four X. I don't remember how. I think from the first thing. Good job. Very good job. The guy sitting in the middle of the track. Hmm. Well, that was something. Third place. Twenty one I rating. Looked like we might have been catching second place there. Maybe if we didn't have to check up as much at some point. 80-86. Probably could have been better on the tires, but it felt pretty good. Alright. I'll take it. I don't know how much that's going to help me. In terms of what our league race is going to look like. But I guess getting some laps... <laughs> I guess getting some laps counts for something. I do feel like I got a little more comfortable with how to drive this thing. Uh, well, let's try to get through this moderately quickly. The first thing's a blink, somehow. We got one person getting loose, coming up the track with a broken car, right in everyone's way. So. This guy exits the pits. Yeah, this is a guy that has a YouTube channel that's trying to troll. That's all that is. He's just looking for reactions. Like, there's no way anyone does this. By accident. It's just sitting in the middle of the track with everybody coming. He knows what he's doing. I, I, I don't know. I don't know, man. I feel like someone not trying to cause a wreck would get off the guy right there. That sucks that we have to have someone like that in a race. So we watch this all happening. We have to lose a whole bunch of time waiting for them. Before it comes down and hits me, I almost get right rear right there. That is so incredibly lucky that I did not get hooked. That's where our 4X came from because the 4 was just hard left on the wheel mad at the 15 because he was trying to turn him. That's something that happened. So. Then he toes because he has to have plausible deniability so that way he doesn't get an account banned. He can just say, oh, I wasn't trying to do it. It wasn't on purpose. I'm just new to eye racing. That's how they avoid getting banned. Don't he hits the wall on entry and gets loose. And then slides up and into 16. There's this guy quote unquote accidentally getting loose on exit, despite going so far off pace. He's just coming out with his fast repair. There's no way you accidentally spin right there. On purpose. Or on accident. There's no way. I don't believe it. Mm-hmm. 
That's intentional. Coming up on the track. Uh, do you want to bet that this guy, Alex Tang, started with Alex A. Tang, Alex B. Tang, and just keeps making new accounts? Like, how pathetic. That That's how people find enjoyment. Is this guy intentionally wrecking people, too? Might be, um in a discord call with the other guy or something. He doesn't even try to hide it here. I guess he's upset because the guy ran into his bumper while he's 20 miles an hour off pace. I mean, as before, you probably shouldn't run in the back of him. But I can tell you what you also shouldn't do is hard hook it right into the guy. Like, this is just sad. That guy was in fourth. And that's after already having to deal with the intentional wrecker. Hmm. <sighs> Twenty doing the same thing you did earlier. Spinning again. Or is this the same one? Nope, that's a different one. Does he toe? He does. And this guy was real sketchy too. He gets loose on exit, I guess. Why you would turn it back onto the track, I have no idea. It's not even on the brakes. Just swerving. Nearly collects me there. It really looks like he's aiming for people. These could just be guys that just don't know what they're doing, though. Only the one guy is someone I'm convinced is trying to wreck people. But look how close that was. That's within netcode reach. Like, the game could have predicted that he hit me and it would have been in the end. If I gets in the wall on his own, that might have been when I saw he lost some time, so I just assumed it was lap cars or something. But I remember I gained about a whole second on him at one point. Four on the wall. Evan drifts up into him. That looks pretty intentional. Why is he parking in the middle of the racing line? This guy's been questionable too. Mm. Yeah, no one in their right mind stops the car right there. On the racing line like that. So I think this guy is probably in on it too. In on it too. I don't know, maybe I'm just, I've got my tinfoil hat on too tight, but I don't think anyone in their right mind parks the car right there, unless they're trying to cause wrecks. Just a couple of middle schoolers giggling to each other in their Discord chat. So we get another big pile up. And I lose a little bit more faith in humanity. Wall. Here, I was worried he was going to pull it off and hit me. This guy's in the wall, comes down. I didn't even look at the incidents yet, how many we got. Oh, not too many. Just kidding. <laughs> oh, man.
So fifth place looks like he... Oh, what happened there? Looked like he blew a tire. That was weird. Is wheel disconnect? Well, his, his car's broken now. I, I don't know. I don't. I can't explain much of anything I'm seeing. A lot of nothing right there. And this is after the race. I think the five is just celebrating that he survived. And you know what? I get it. So that'll do it. Um, I don't think I can say anything that this race hasn't already said for me. So thank you for watching. That was just pure chaos. And... Uh, I'm hoping that the league race looks a little bit better than that. If it doesn't, I think Nick just completely nukes the league immediately without a second thought. So that'll do it. <laughs> Thanks for watching, and I will see you next time. Have a good one.